Hi everyone, uh, this is size 10, straight shark hook and the thread I'm using is fluoro green. You can use any color you want but I like this color. I've been tying these in them for the past couple of years but I just decided to upload. So I'll explain the materials as usual. Now, you can use any other tail, but this is actually a bayet tail. Uh, color is yellow, so you need to take two tails, two strand, or two bayet tails, just, you know, um, you can use single, but they'll not be strong enough, so I normally use two. So, just a little longer than a body. And then catch it gently, take your time, make sure they're sitting properly. And then secure them. That looks fine. Keep going just on the bend and just come back again just to give a little tug. Next step is ribbing, which is, uh, this is a um, gold rib, small size, and this is a tinsel actually, not a wire, so and just cover all this up, all the way, lift this up and chop it off. then go back towards the tail now for body I'm using my soft hairs here it's got some UV glitter mix and I'm going to tilt my voice uh, so I can get my hand around. Take your time. It's been working really well for the past couple of years, you know, and I was also selling these quite a lot so you can use different color different tail and spin the bobbin so you could see it properly now take your time And now all you have to do is bring the ribs leave nice amount of gap couple of millimeter or oh, depend on the size of the fly you take your time make sure it's sitting nicely and then secure this Take this off. I need 
create some more box on your thread. Come back and the same dubbing. And for the head, I added a little bit more flash in it. So this one, make sure you take your time and dub it properly. Kind of wet your fingers and then it will sit properly. And now just kind of build up a little larger head. Now form the head. Nice and decent size. And we finish. That's fine. This is completed now. All you have to do is just get your dubbing brush and scruff it up a little bit. So once you're happy. scissor to trim it down a little bit excessive amount sticking out and final bit is just a varnish just put a decent amount of varnish on the head here don't worry about the eyes if it gets covered. We'll open it up with a needle or something. So there we have by a tailed nymph. I hope you enjoy this video. Thanks for watching.